हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू ए न्यू वीडियो टू डेज टॉपिक इज माइक्रोसॉफ्ट वर्ड यूजर इंटरफेस दिस इज आवर फर्स्ट एपिसोड ऑन माइक्रोसॉफ्ट वर्ड वी विल कवर इट स्टेप बाय स्टेप इन अपकमिंग एपिसोड्स एवरीथिंग विल बी एक्सप्लेन इन सिंपल वे फॉर बिगिनर सो विदाउट एनी डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट एट द वीडियो सो फ्रेंड्स फर्स्ट वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज माइक्रोसॉफ्ट वर्ड Microsoft Word is a word processing software developed by Microsoft. It is mainly used to create edit format and print document. People use it for writing letter, resume, note, book and much more. With MX Word, you can type and edit text easily, format text using font, colors and style, insert table, pictures, chart and shape. check spelling and grammar, shape and print professional documents. All friends have understood Here is the interface of Microsoft Word. So friends, at the top left corner of Microsoft Word, you will find the quick access toolbar. This toolbar give you quick access to commonly used commands, auto save, save, undo and redo. The best thing is you can customize by adding your favorite tools so you can work faster without searching again and again. That's why it's called the quick access toolbar. At the top center of MX Word you will see the title bar. The title bar shows the name of your document along with the program name MX Word. If your file is new and not yet saved, it will appear as document 1, but once you save it, the title bar update and show the name you gave to your file. That's why its title bar is very useful to identify which document you are working on. On the top right corner of every Windows program, you will see three small button: minimize, maximize, restore down, and close button. The minimize button hide the window from the screen but keeps it running in the task bar. The restore down button brings the window back to its smaller size. If the window are already is smaller size, the button change to maximize which enlarges the window to full screen. The close button completely shut down the program. This button help you easily control your applications window. Just below the title bar in Microsoft Word, you will find the ribbon. It has tabs like home, insert, draw, design and layout. Each tab has group of commands such as font, paragraph and style. This ribbon is your main control center in Microsoft Word. The ribbon is divided into multiple tabs like home, insert, draw, design and layout. Each tab has specific group of command. For example, let's talk about the home tab. Contain this group's keyboard, font, paragraph, style groups. That's why the home tab is the most commonly used tabs for text formatting and editing. This is the work area in MX Word where we create and work with the content of our document. The status bar is the bar at the bottom of the Word window that show informations about your document like page number. word count language option view button are located at the bottom right corner of the word window they allow you to switch between the different view of your document like read mode print layout and web layout so you can see your content in the way you want next the zoom control is located at the bottom right corner of the word window It allows you to increase or decrease the view size of your document. You zoom in to see details clearly or zoom out to see the whole page. The vertical scroll bar is on the left side of the window. It lets you move up and down through your document. And the horizontal scroll bar is at the bottom of the window. It lets you move left and right to see part of the document. that are out of view the vertical ruler is on the right side of the document it help you adjust top and bottom margin and position object vertically the horizontal ruler is at the top of the document it help you margin indent and top stop so friend you much have understood the user interface if you found it helpful don't forget to hit the like button and share with your friend Also make sure to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so you never miss an update. See you in the next episode till then take care and keep learning.